Hello everyone, Warfra here. We're going to play Redemption Cemetery 12, Day of the Almost Dead. Because there are a lot of Redemption Cemetery games and they are actually kind of cool. Uh, hopefully that uh, cutscene was not deafening like they usually are. Um, maybe I found a way to make them, you know, less loud. Um, so, but I mean, they are, they are, they are loud. So anyways, looks like we have the Day of the Dead here, but it's, you know, the Day of the Almost Dead, and I presume those three souls that whoever it is needs to take over the world is the three souls we're gonna save, so, yo. Oh no. Oh! We got this again. Love it. So many mysteries to solve. But so many left. So many mysteries solved. Okay, I definitely recognize this. I cannot say which game it is, but... One new message. Santa Muerte. Hi, Wordfire. I know you're a well-known myth debunker, and that you've already saved innocent souls from evil. I need your help. We're all in danger. How'd you know about me? Who are you? I don't have much time. There's a tradition in Mexico on the day of Mexico. The day of the dead, people come to the cemetery to visit their deceased relatives. But for the but for the last three years, on this day at midnight, people disappear from the cemetery. Take a look at this video I shot last year. Come before midnight to this address. I'll wait for you at the cemetery, because today is the Day of the Dead. Redemption Cemetery! Santa Muerte offline. I love that it's actually- they're all- like these cemeteries are all called literally Redemption Cemetery. Like that is where we're going. Also our profile picture in this whatever it is forum. Sure, full tutorial. This is the place! Santa Muerte must be behind those gates. Throughout the game, you'll meet many characters. Talk to the Keeper. I'm sorry, but in our city, there's a centuries-old tradition of celebrating the Day of the Dead. I don't let visitors in until the clock strikes midnight. Yeah, your answer is shown here. It is it is almost midnight. I need to get into the cemetery and meet Santa Muerte. I don't know anything about that. And there's definitely no living being in the cemetery. Rules are rules. The gate will only open at midnight. You'll have to wait like the other visitors. Your task list records what you need to be doing during your adventure. You came, but I feel that they're already here. It's too late. Here, take my phone. It can help. Oh no, what's going on? Let me see what I can see. I was about to say nobody else is seeing this. I must find a way to stop Shibalba, or our world will perish. That clue must help open the gates. A magnifier appears when you can zoom in on something. Hand appears so you can pick up an item. Locked bag. You can open certain items in their own window and interact with them. These items are marked with a skull in your inventory. But it's red. Well, this bag definitely opens with a cosmic key. I'll take this incomplete skull. I'm sorry to take your offerings to your deceased family members. I better find a way to save all these poor people. <laughs> yes. A collection. Okay. Why does this viking helmet have horns on it? Uh, okay. Um, a, a bunch of countries? Wait. Wait. Can I just... What are 
the collectibles. All right, it's stuff, not the thing from last game. All right, cool. Just I know what it is. Use a hint if you need help. The hint button must be recharged after each use. I do not know, need. If the wax melts, the rose is released. Oh, ragged doll. Hello. Flower charm. Uh oh, we want to repair you. Of course. Absolutely. If there's good, there must always be evil. According to the legend, Kalaka is the accomplice of Shebalba. He gathers innocent souls to enable Shebalba to enter the world of the living and give Kalaka immortality. His most distinctive feature is magically glowing eyes. That that would be distinctive. Oh, hello. Gate skull. Uh, I wonder what these keys are for. I don't know, the gate maybe? Wonder what these keys unlock. I really don't. The di the the diary. The day of the dead is a centuries old tradition. This year the cemetery gates will open exactly at midnight as they have for hundreds of years. All right, that's probably a bad thing. Uh, 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 uh. Yes, you can use things on your inventory. Amaze beans. Oh. I didn't realize I could have just done that immediately. Cool. Okay, let's go. Um. Wild key. Alright, when you're ready to explore a new location, look for areas where your icon changes to a nav navigation icon. Time plays an important role in this case. <laughs> it usually does. Use the map to travel to other locations instantly. Don't think that's what I need to be doing right now. You can't stop me. My master needs three souls, and today, he'll get them. That guy definitely doesn't want me to interfere. Which is why we're going to interfere. Sparkling areas indicate places where you can zoom in and play hidden object puzzles. Okay, why is she a hidden object puzzle? Must find missing gems to get the keys. Thank you for your help. You're just in time. I'm Santa Muerte, and it was I who called you here. Help Santa Muerte tell the story by finding all the listed elements. Today, on the Day of the Dead, people have come to this cemetery to see their families. But on this sacred day, Shibalba can break out and turn the world of living into the world of the dead. My dream showed me that only you can save us. <laughs> no pressure. I mean, we've done this 11 times already, so I mean... <laughs> The video I sent you is only one from many people who have disappeared. They'll die before their time if Shibalba succeeds. I don't have the strength to deal with this alone. Three wayward souls are left. If they're lost, we are doomed. You must save them. It's our only sprout of hope. I 
I'm leaving you my assistant, Raven. He'll help you in difficult situations. Ha! <laughs> yes! The obligatory assistant, Raven. Let's go. I am okay with that. Whoa! Select the achievements button. See all the achievements you've earned. Do not need right now. I'll play you for it. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, is he always doing that? Ah. All right, cool. With a star candle. Uh, frozen ice on a night like this? How strange. Wow, what an enormous door! Aurelia, 1973 to 1981. When the icon changes on the raven, it's time to use your helper. Yes. Thank you! Oh, oh no. no, he got to the first soul. Hurry, we must open the door. He has Aure Aurelia. No. Arrange the gems according to the numbers marked on them and their keys matching colors. Like two gems to swap them. Red key, blue key, and green key. Hurry, we must open the door. Yes, yes. You can find collection items in certain locations. Uh Select the collections button. <laughs> Alright. The Aztecs believed that Mictlantecutli was god of the underworld, a place called Mictlan. He was portrayed as a bloodied skeleton or a man with a toothy skull. Mictlantecutli. I love information. This is amaze beans. Yes. I want to learn, especially about other cultures. Bernardo, you showed much promise in racing, but after your brother's death you just did nothing. Rest in peace, dear friend. Oh no. I wonder what this empty inset thing is. Uh, hi. No, stop! If I don't get this soul after death, I'll take it in life. Oh no, Kalaka's powers wounded Santa Muerte. This is Aurelia's altar. Kalaka went to the past for her soul. You must summon Aurelia's soul to follow and stop him. Light all the candles and bring her favorite doll to do it. I feel my time has come. Everything is in your hands now. Farewell. Wait, how can Santa Muerte die? What? Something must get rid of these thorns. Oh, the people outside were coming to- yeah, so so the man we took the doll from, he was coming for Aurelia. A father, maybe? Broken buttons? Ooh. This is interesting. Needle and thread.
Um, Oh no. Um, I see. No, wait, that one is there. It's an Uroboros, a snake that bites its own tail. In the circle a sign for eternity. Exists in many, many cultures with different names. In Norse mythology, it's called Midgors Urman, or whatever his the actual name is. Do not remember. This flower is incomplete. To restore the altar, replace missing candles to make the soul respond, bring their favorite item to make the soul appear, light all candles. All right. Aurelia, dear, forgive me. I didn't know that Francesca's death left you alone. Longing for your mother, you followed her after only a week. You remain in my memory as a bright child, embracing the doll that your mother gave you. Your loving uncle is outside, Rodrigo. Hmm. Rodrigo is outside, yes. Yay! Whoa. Oh. There we go. Aurel Aurelia's doll. Whoa! Now we need the candles and to light them. Up. I don't think there's anything we can do there. And nothing there. So, something out here. No. Alright, map. Help. Objectives. All right. Oh. Casual hard. To summon Aurelia's soul, light all the candles. Select a candle to light it. Lighting one may affect others. know what I'm trying to do, but... Yes. Hello, Aurelia! And you know what? That is perfect time to take a break, and we will uh, go help out Aurelia in the next episode. So thank you all very much for watching, and I will see ya!